Good morning, Tennessee High School. Today is Monday, August 24th, and I'm Josh. And I'm Rose, and you're watching Viking News. Underclassmen, faculty, staff, and administration photos will be on Tuesday, August 25th. All photos must be prepaid. Students may pay the photographer on picture day, or photos may be ordered online at mylifetouch.com with a code located on the THS website. La the last day for senior photos is Monday, August 24th at THS. Seniors who wish to appear in the yearbook must have their photo made on this date. The sitting fee is $25. If a senior needs a retake, he or she should bring his or her proofs to the photographer in, or in order to avoid the sitting fee on August 24th. French Club will have a meeting immediately after school for current members as well as those interested in joining on August 24th in Ms. Toby's room. Current 11th and 12th grade French Club members interested in applying to be an officer see Ms. Toby for an application, for application form. Forms are due by the first meeting. And now here's Haley and Jordan with your weather forecast. Good morning, Tennessee High. I'm Jordan. And I'm Haley. And this is your weather forecast for Monday, August 24th. Today will be a high of 82 and a low of 64 and a chance of thunderstorms. Now back to the studio for your cafe watch. Senior ads are due Friday, September 12th. English teacher Davis Strickland is leading a trip to Italy during spring break of 2016. This is a once-in-a-lifetime trip with opportunity for monthly payments. Please email strickland.c at btcs.org if you have any questions. The Interact Club is now accepting new members. Students interested in joining should pick up an application in the library or in the main office. Applications for memberships are due August 28th. See Ms. DeClerc or Ms. Demma for more information. Wrestling preseason practice for boys and girls takes place today from 3 to 4.30 at 320 Bluff City Highway. Any wrestler not playing a fall sport should plan to attend preseason practice. Preseason workouts are also a great opportunity for anyone who would like to try wrestling for the first time. Please contact Coach, Coach Marshall at tmarshall at bties.tv. Now here's your cafe watch. Timing may be right for Tennessee to reclaim its status as an SEC contender. Tennessee has restocked its talent base and has ended a string of four straight losing seasons, just as many of its SEC East Division rivals have entered a state of transition. That combination has led to questions about whether the Volunteers can challenge for their first division title since 2007. A preseason poll of SEC media tennis has Tennessee finishing second in the East behind Georgia. In local news, the Bristol Mall was sold for $2 million on the steps of Bristol Virginia Courthouse last week. The buyer was a, credit, a creditor to which the mall owed money. The note holder said he was hired by an attorney's office out of Washington, D.C. and did not know what he was bidding for. In national news, former U.S. President Jimmy Carter is being treated for cancer. He's in, the, he's in the advanced stages of the disease and has been told he has months left to live. That's all for Viking News. Have a wonderful Monday.